Have you ever faced a situation where you tried to delete files and folders on your Windows computer but failed? Well, it's a common problem and might have happened to everyone. Sometimes the malware also prevents you from deleting files and folders. In this video, we will show you how you can delete undeletable files on Windows and keep your system clean from junk or irrelevant files occupying unnecessary space. So first you have to try to change permissions. Normally this error will be related to an actual permission problem. So let's try that out before trying other options. Right click on the folder that you want to delete. Select properties from the list. Now click on security tab. Then click on edit button. Under group and usernames, select your username. And here in the permissions, uncheck all the boxes for deny and make sure to check all the boxes for allow. Then click on apply and hit ok. Now try deleting the file or folder again. If this doesn't work, try the next solution. Use command prompt. Click on the windows search icon, type cmd in the search bar. Now right click on the command prompt from the search result and select run as administrator from the list. Next in the command prompt window, type cd slash t. Now right click on the folder or file you want to delete and select properties. From here copy the file location and paste it here and press enter. Now type dir slash x and hit enter. Here you'll see your file name. Enter the command rmdir slash q slash s and then type your file name and press enter. Now your folder will automatically delete. Third is to try rebooting the system. In many cases, restarting your computer can fix many computer errors. So you can try to reboot your computer to fix this issue. After rebooting, try deleting the file or folder again. Hope this video will be helpful for you.